The daily number of coronavirus infections confirmed in Russia had doubled over the past week, going from over 15,000 on January 10 to over 330,000 on Tuesday. Officials say the surge could end up as the country's biggest yet, but so far haven't announced any major restriction to stem it. In addition, the government has shortened the isolation period for COVID-positive persons to one week. Earlier rules required a two-week isolation period with a mandatory follow-up test on day 11. Deputy Prime Minister Tatiana Golikova said the move was to optimize the approach to quarantine and testing. Golikova added that the other policy changes will be adopted in the coming days, but did not disclose details on the reason behind the cut. Anna Popova, the head of Russian public health watchdog Rospotrep Nadzor, said last week that new daily cases might reach six figures. And President Vladimir Putin has said that Russia has a couple of weeks to prepare for the unprecedented wave. Prime Minister Mikhail Mishutin said on Tuesday the recent surge hasn't led to a spike in hospitalization so far. And on Friday, the government decided to indefinitely postpone introducing restriction for unvaccinated people, which will have been extremely unpopular among vaccine-hesitant Russians. Just about half of Russia's population of 146 million have been fully vaccinated.